This is what we're going to be baking today. Um, real simple, real easy, but uh, got to have them. Got to have them on the table. So I've prepared all my ingredients. I got everything out ready to go. I got all my dry ingredients here and some wet ingredients. And uh, now we're going to make a little magic. Uh, it's important to follow the directions. Don't try to ad lib. So uh, no extra this, extra that. So I'm going to put a little egg, sugar, vanilla, little milk, oil, vegetable oil. Always use new ingredients. Don't use like year-old, two-year-old stuff. Don't be cheap. Stuff goes bad. I'm going to just mix this up. Nice. Get it going. We got four eggs in there. Got uh, three quarters of a cup of sugar. A lot of vanilla in this recipe. So it's giving it the, the flavor. It's just a plain old bread cookie, so the vanilla gives it the old uh, taste. We got this nice. We're just gonna mix it nice. We're not gonna whip it up. Warp it up. We're just gonna mix it now. Get them all incorporated, especially that oil. Then we're gonna dump our wet ingredients in our dry, mix it up. This is a simple cooking, anybody can make it. Yeah. It's the look, the feel, you gotta have that little touch, you know? Alright, there we go. That's ready, so I'm just gonna dump this in here a little bit at a time. Get this going. Make a well. Dump it in the center of the well. And then that's it. We're gonna start incorporating that all together. If it's a little wet, it's okay, because we could just take a little flour later, add it in there, boom, done. Nice and easy. I'll be back in a minute. So, I, I, I was able to mix everything up, got it going. It was a little wet. I kept adding a little flour, pushing it around. You gotta wait for the feel, the look, the smell. You gotta put it in your hands. You don't call me Joey Hands for nothing. This is the texture, I can feel it. This is it. I'm gonna put it in a bowl. I'm gonna let it rest a little bit. I'm gonna get the, the baking pan ready um, and clean up over here. I'm going to start rolling out some cookies. Now we're ready to do some bacon. There's a couple little things we can do here. Normally we, uh, we make these little like snake guys. You remember this, right guys? We roll them out like this. And then you can do something like a twist or you can make a knot. That's that typical cookie you see in the store. Just make a little knot. Throw it up there. You can, uh, Make a couple of twist cookies. Roll your snake out like that. You know? And you just give it a little twist like that. Right? And then, boom, done. That's what you gotta do. You make all the cookies. I'm gonna make some round ones too. Put a little punch in the middle with the thumb, put it on there. Those we're gonna dip. Make those nice. My favorites are the knots. So the knots I do like this. Just roll out a little snake. And then make a knot. That's it. And repeat. Keep making them. Got to make like three dozen. So we're in the home stretch here for the uh, first batch. I'm just rolling out some of these little snake guys here. Again, you could make these any way. But uh, my traditional way is uh, to make the knots. Love the knots. Boom, bang, boom. Put them up. Another thing you could do is uh, make a nice long snake out of it here. All that puppy out nice. It's all in the hands. Joey hands. Gotta have the feel. You know, you can't make this stuff up. This ain't no uh, Oreo chocolate chip. Oh, chip Mahoy garbage. This is the real stuff. So another thing we do is we take this and we just give it a twist, you know? You twist it around like a, a twist. 
twist. And make a little loop with it. Boom, that's beautiful. That stuff's beautiful. I'm gonna take another piece and make like a pretzel with it. Roll it out good. Make it like a big pretzel. Yeah, it's like a pretzel. Cut that bad boy, throw him right up there. And then we got, we got space for one more. We'll make a round one. Make little cookies. Give it a little. That's it. We got the oven all going, 350, convex bait, and uh, we're gonna fold them in. I'll be back in a minute. So we got the first batch in there, about 20, 22 minutes. We'll see how it comes out. Lightly browned on the bottom. And uh, in the meantime, I'm gonna roll out some more cookies. I'm getting the final batch in. Um, we're in the home stretch here. Let me just throw in this second tray. We got to stack it in here nice. Gonna set my timer. Boom, done. While that last batch is in there, I'm gonna clean up a little bit, and we're gonna get um, gotta get the icing going. So we're just getting ready to finish up the last batch. They're gonna come out of the oven now. We're gonna let them cool. I'm getting together a little icing over here. We're gonna make this into like a paste. It's a little light. I gotta work on it. Get a little bit thicker, and uh, then we're gonna do up the little decorations. Oh yeah, he's perfect. He's coming out looks great. First batch is in. Second batch. That's nice. Hit that. We're all good. We're all good. In the home stretch here, we're gonna decorate the cookies a little bit. I got a nice uh, icing here. Now, sometimes people want to do one or two different dunks. Depends on how thick you want the icing. I'm going to go a little light on them. I'm not going to go crazy. Because besides the icing, I'm going to decorate it a little bit. Some of these bad boy sprinkles, you know. Just, 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 just to dress it up a little bit. That's the Christmas spirit right there. That's what I'm talking about. See? You get a little dunk. I'm gonna get a little red, a little green. I'm gonna mix it up a little bit, red and green. See? Go for the dunk. That's however you want them to come out. These are Christmas cookies. It's all about making them. It's not about perfect, not perfect. I'm gonna give a little sprinkle of this. I'm gonna give a little sprinkle of the, uh, the green. I'm do a little red and green. Christmas colors. And repeat, repeat, repeat. So we got the first batch all done. I got a little work to do with these uh, with the icing. This is what we got going on. Um, he's got to dry. Um, and then we're going to get the other batch going. This is uh, Holiday Cooking Baking 102. Uh, Joey Hands to the kids. Hope to see some homemade goodies from you to me. God bless.